Hello everyone, welcome back to the Storm 33. I am Tatiana. I'm here with more summons for our summons from November the 11th, 2024. We'll be reading Titus chapter 1 in the New Testament. Y'all yeah, should know who these people are. And look, at, look on the screen in the description box for more information. And I think Titus is about me, so let's begin. Paul, a servant of God and a missionary of Yeshua, the Messiah. Now, when y'all see that, that means, okay, I got to tell y'all, I'm going to tell y'all gain terminology. When you took, when you kill somebody, like when you take their honor, let's say this some real street shit, you know what I'm saying? Some real gang life or whatever, blah, blah, blah. So, when you take their honor, you going to be, your name going to be front, and whoever you took, going to be behind you. So that basically what it say. Nini and Kia. So, Emissary of Yeshua, the Messiah. For her. According to the faith of God's chosen ones. And the knowledge of the truth. Which is according to godliness. See? And hope of eternal life. Which God, who can't lie, promised before time began. But in his own time revealed his word in the message which with which I was entrusted according to the commandment of God our Savior. Yeah, that do make sense, huh? So that's probably why I'm like, you know, Jesus of the Messiah is because hell, basically my kids, they gone gone. You know what I'm saying? Like, ain't no faces of them. So it really don't so it's basically just saying, oh, cause I'm the I'm the I'm the mother in the foundation, you know. Well, he my grandson, but he I'm still the mother, you know. Okay. So yeah, that makes sense too. Okay. So Titus. So this yeah. So this what the, this mean the real God talking. Okay. Yes. To Titus, my true child, according to a common faith. Grace, mercy, and peace from God, the Father, and the Lord Yeshua, the Messiah, our Savior. I left you in Crete for this reason. See why I was confused, because y'all killed them to be saved. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I always say it's them. But they always tell me, nah, that's you. But I'm going to just stick to my opinion. I left you in Crete for this reason that you sh okay that you will set in order the things that were lacking and appoint elders in every city as I directed you. Okay, that makes sense because God telling me this. God told me he shows me to do this, okay? Um, one of my daughters, Rose the Elijah Lee, she a tarot reader. She made a video about that in my Akashi Records that I'm here. Mama too, I'm here to crush different systems okay so that basically what it means let me read that again for y'all mainly for me i left you in crete for this reason you know left me in the dark you know that's why i can't do certain things that y'all do i left you in crete for this reason that you will set in set in order the things that were lacking and appoint elders in every city as i directed you if anyone is blameless, the husband of one wife, having children who believe, who are not accused of loose or unruly behavior, who, with, no offense, with frail machine, Michael stopped it. That's why he actually got killed. See, I was going to actually stop it too, but he was like, nah, I'm going to do it. Now, kill your machine, all they ass stopped. But they kept doing it over and over again, like playing and shit. Then they lose my hand, my dead hand. They remember they cut my hand off. So they lose my dead hand to, when they got done playing, they lose my dead hand to do it. But with Jillian, yes, I did stop it. Okay. Um, I'm the only one. They didn't want to stop it because that means they would lose or something like that. So, you know, after, you know, all that stuff happened with Jillian, yes, I stopped it. Second machine, Michael stopped it. Um, the machine, it, all of them stopped it, but my dead hand stopped it, okay? So, yeah. 
For the overseer must be blameless, that's me, as God's steward, not self-pleasing, not easily angered, not given to wine, not violent, not greedy for dishonest gain. Oh, that's so they basically telling y'all why he shows me. But given to hospitality, a lover of good, sober-minded, fair, holy, self-controlled. Holding to the faithful word, which is according to the teaching, that he may be able to exhort in the sound doctrine and to convict those who contradict him. Amen. Now, look here. I ain't going to cap to y'all. I have read the Bible all through my lifetime. You know what I'm saying? I studied it like a motherfucker. I probably understand why people read the Bible because when I read it, I, I, I get it from like a full standpoint. You know what I'm saying? But they not from here, so they ain't going to get this, okay? But it's th- but they wrote it, though, but they ain't going to get it, you know what I'm saying? But no, we can't, okay? Because not, it's not ours. It's just, this is going to be a legacy. The Bible is going to be a legacy, okay, y'all? For there are also many unruly men, vain talkers and deceivers, especially those of the circumcision, okay? Um... Mainly the people in the group, okay, that got cut off. Uh, even your penis, okay, that's what it means, okay. But yeah, don't get your shit cut off. But yeah, that means you cut off, okay. Or it might be us, whose mouths must. Or anything is them, whose mouths must be stopped. Men who overthrow whole houses, teaching things which they ought not, for this gain's sake. One of them, a prophet of their own, said, Cretans are always liars, evil beasts, and idle gluttons, which is all of us down there in hell. This testimony is true. For this cause, we prove them sharply that they may be sound in the faith. I do take care of some of them down there. Okay, they eat and everything, just like y'all, okay? That's probably what it means, too, when it says Jesus be feeding them. But I do, though. I feed them, you know what I'm saying? They just can't get out the motherfucking thing, though. But they can do stuff in there, though. They can do stuff in there. They just don't want to be down there. They want to go where they were supposed to go. But they, you know, I mean, ain't got no room or nothing. But, yeah, you know what I mean, right? Okay. They don't mind for now, okay? Some of them don't want to come out. Some some do want to come out. Some don't want to come out right now, so it's kind of hard. But they know what they is, though. Not paying attention to Jewish fables and commitments of men who turn away from the truth. Who? Okay? It's supposed to be. Okay? I mean, the blood did write the Bible, so. To the pure, all things are pure. But to those who are defiled and unbelieving, nothing is pure. But both their mind and their conscience are defiled. See? They fucked up out here. They profess that they know God, see, but by their deeds they deny Him, being abominable, disobedient, and unfit for any good work. Amen. Read that again for y'all, because they really believe they are. They really believe that they is a God. They really believe this shit. They don't really listen. They don't. They don't. They don't think He's real. Okay, because Gina, like, and when she was in the middle, it was just only her. And then, like, she was the only, she was, like, the first one to pop out of the mirror. And then all the motherfuckers, then all the other motherfuckers popped out with her. So, they why she say she's just God. And they the gods. Okay? But, remember where you get this machine from. You stole it from the real one. Okay? So, baby girl. Let me read it one more time for you. Or let me read two more times for y'all. I like that. They profess that they know God, but by their deeds, they deny him, being animal, disobedient, and unfit for any good work. Last one. They profess that they know God, but by their deeds, they deny him, being animal, disobedient, and unfit for any good work. And that is Titus chapter 1 in the New Testament in Jah.